guys, your boy Dizo, um, back again with another video. Um, first off, today is November 19th. I don't know when I'll upload this video, but uh, as for November 19th, Dad, happy birthday back in Cebu. I'm sorry I'm not there already. I mean, I'm sorry I'm not there anymore. Um, but I hope you had a good uh, birthday celebration, even if I'm not there. I hope uh, you got to spend time uh, with you and your family and with mom. Um, I miss you guys and uh, I hope that uh, next year you might be here or I'll, I'll be there for your birthday. But anyways, look about that. Let's get on with the shoe. Uh, today we're going to be talking about um, the Jordan 9s. I copped a uh, Jordan 9 Kobe PE. Uh, PE stands for Player Edition in, in case uh, you guys don't know what that means. Um, it, that's gonna be like my one, two, three, four, five. That's my sixth Kobe nine. I mean, uh, sixth uh, Jordan nine. Um, in a different colorway. I've had the uh, OG, the Citrus, the Militia Green, the Anthracite, the Motorboat Jones, and now I have the Kobe nine PEs. So, uh, this was supposed to be raffled off, but, um, good friends in, uh, in some stores, uh, let me cop, um, even if I didn't even have a raffle, and they're not supposed to sell me, um, the shoe yet. Let me see if I can find the time right here. I got the shoes for retail. Um, as you can see... Got the shoes 121 in the afternoon. I don't know if the camera is focusing or not. They're not supposed to sell the shoes, I think, at 3 or at 6 for those who didn't have the, uh, the tickets or the raffle. Who didn't win the raffle, but uh, they sold me the shoes anyway. So, here we go. The Jordan 9 Kobe PE. white and purple although I'll be honest with you guys I'm colorblind I really don't see purple I see blue <laughs> but I know that's supposed to be purple or it might be even blue who knows it says conquered so whatever but I like the colorway this is a uh, in memory of Kobe being in the Lakers, um, I like how the uh, patent leather sits really nice um, below the uh, white upper right here. And uh, so far, uh, this this is the only Kobe nine. I, I mean, uh, forgive me for saying Kobe. Over and over again. It just reminds me of Kobe so much. Uh, just the colorway. But the uh, this has been the only Jordan 9 that has all the uh, lace holes or the aglets that's chromed out from top to bottom. Although the GS doesn't have the bottom one. But um, although there was another Jordan 9 that had almost all of it except this one chromed out. And the... Uh, Jordan 9 low chrome, I believe that's what it's called. So, all of it was the same, but low cut, all white. But this one, but the uh, bottom most aglets was not chromed out. Um, you can see Laker colors. Jordan, Air Jordan right here is colored yellow. One other thing I'm, I'm, I really wanted personally was that they changed the back to 24 instead or on one pair have a number 8 and then a 24, you know, in memory of Kobe, but uh, they didn't do it. Um, I don't really care, but as much as uh, I wanted to, they should have done that. Just, just uh, 
just in favor of Kobe being in the same brand uh, with Nike together with Jordans, but they didn't. But I'm so good with this shoe. Still looks clean. Um, all right, uh, back with the shoe. The reason why they look like this, these ones right here, they're a reminder of baseball cleats. That one, and also this one right here on the midsole. It's supposed to remind everybody of the uh, days when uh, Jordan was playing baseball because this was the year that he was playing baseball. He didn't actually use this one to play basketball um, during the time it came out. He was actually playing baseball when he retired. Um, one thing I really like about the uh, nines is the uh, storytelling. The uh, outsole has there's actually a lot, especially the. Uh, foreign words that are up here. I might need help with that with my cheat sheet. But uh, starting off, we got, uh, let me get that cheat sheet right now for you guys. Starting off, we got the uh, the world logo right there. I mean, uh, the world right there. As you can see, this was the year that, that Jordan Brand wanted to glo uh, go global with their uh, shoe selling. That's why they got this one right here too and uh, actually the two shoes have different writings on it so on the right foot as you can see you can see right here right there it means dedicated in French force in Spanish intense in Italian Freedom in French and then graceful in German. And on the other foot, it says sport in Russian, independence in Swahili, freedom in Russian, Germ uh, in German that means athletic, and in another Swahili is hope on the last on the last word right here. Um, all in all, I like. I like where uh, Jordan Brand was going with this one. In memory of Kobe, um, what else can I say about the shoe? Jordan 9s, if you guys been following me, the reason why I like 9s was because this was the first, Jordan 9s was the first pair of Jordans I ever owned when I was a kid, when I was in uh, second grade, and I had the OG ones. Um, I just mentioned my dad earlier, greeting him a happy birthday. It was because of my dad that I had my first pair of Jordans. Um, yeah. After this one, there's going to be an arm foot in the end of the video. Uh, guys, check him out. If you guys uh, need help uh, with shoes being hooked up, if you're in the Philippines or elsewhere in the world, um, I'd be happy to help you out. i put my details uh, in the end of the video. All right, guys. See you guys next time. Peace. Jay's on my feet, you know. Jay's on my feet, you know. Jay's on my feet, you know. So get like me. Jay's on my feet, you know. Jay's on my feet, we trip. Jay's on my feet, we trip. So get like me. I be in the club, standing on the couch, in the wolf gray, like it's my house. Drinking out the bottle, I got no respect. Looking like a model, who just got a check. I back it up, cause I don't give a fuck I don't. If you were lame, that's a shame, you can't hang with us uh -uh. I'm MC Hammerfly, you can't touch Jay so fly, I should work it